Welcome back, everyone. You may be having an issue with your specific Apple Watch where you're not receiving notifications. So to fix this, what you want to do, and the easiest way to fix this for the most part, is to actually make your way to the bottom of your specific Apple Watch and swipe up to get into this specific panel. Now, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you're, first of all, connected to your iPhone. So to verify that, you want to make sure you have at least this signal on. But at the very top right here, you'll be able to see that little green phone icon. If you see a phone icon and it has like an X around it or it's grayed out or you don't even see a phone icon, that means you are not connected to a phone. If you're not connected to a phone and if you don't have the cellular model of that device, then you're pretty much not good to go. You will not get any signal. If you have the cell signal version of a, you know, your Apple Watch, then you should still be able to receive some notifications. If you don't see that, then that's kind of an issue in and of itself. But another thing is if you see that and you're still not receiving notifications, you want to make sure that this little moon icon right here, you want to make sure that that doesn't actually have, you want to make sure that this specific icon isn't on. So if this is on, you can see it's a do not disturb. So if you have it on basically all the time, it's not going to allow you to get any notifications. So if I turn this on like this, look what happens. I'll have this little option on, but if I swipe down, most of the time you'll see a little snooze icon or a little moon icon right up there. That means you have an issue. So you just want to make sure this is off and you should be good to go there. Now, if you still aren't receiving notifications, you may need to update your Apple Watch. So to do this, what you want to do is you want to click on your digital crown. You want to go ahead and make your way over to your settings here. You can go ahead and actually make your way over to your notifications panel within settings. So click here and you just want to make sure your notifications indicator is on that you basically just get all these little other things on too. If you want to go ahead and have them, you know, turn on as you kind of use them. But another thing you can do is go and click on general, which is right here. You want to scroll on to software update and you want to go and update your Apple Watch. If there's an update available, you want to go and update to it. And that could end up fixing your problem as well. If you're still experiencing issues, I'd recommend probably resetting your Apple Watch, updating your Apple Watch, or repairing your Apple Watch to your specific iPhone. So that's pretty much the process. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, know me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.